Hello oh guys, this is Triple Code Broker and in this video we're going to learn how to use vectors. Alright, so let's go ahead and include the vector library and the IO stream of course. And the use of vectors actually, what makes uh, a vector useful is actually the fact that uh, they have built-in functions that you can use and they have uh, a very good time alright so to declare run you write down vector then type that, it, that has in it and then the name of it so sample one alright so how to add elements alright so first of all how to how you can actually add an element in the in the back of it all right so how to do it you write down sample dot push back and the element that you want to push like uh, I'm gonna push 12 so let's, let's actually push three twelves all right that's how you actually do it there's also another function that returns the size so if I wanna output it output actually what it contains I can write down this thing uh, sample dot size I plus plus and this will go until I reach the end the last element of sample alright fine so what I'm actually expecting right now is three twelves output it yeah. in a line uh, sorry in three lines there you go let's let's change the one thing so we can we can show that this really happens so as you can see that's how it's done that's how it's done all right another thing that is useful is to insert an, an element uh, in the end or sorry insert an element in any position that I actually war want so I don't sample dot insert sorry insert in sample dot begin so it gives a begin iterator plus the position that I want to add it so I want to add it in the third position I write down two because we start numbering from one zero two as you know and then I write down what I want to add so this is the number that I want to add to insert and let's do it again let's actually output our vector a second time after actually inserting this number so f9 and there we go but let's actually uh, do this thing right here All right so we're outputting after inserting there you go in the third place as I said all right um and I think that is very useful for our vectors is sorting uh, which is included in another library which is algorithm algorithm and without we write down actually sort sample right sample uh, dot begin until sample dot end and then we're gonna output it for a second time so we're, we're gonna uh, configure that this happens indeed let's change our numbers for a little bit and let's try down this message after sorting right. there we go, end line sorry, caps lock, alright, there we go and then output it again and compile a run there we go before sorting it was like that and after sorting, there we go the elements are sorted Alright, so these are the functions that I would like to show you, the pushback function, the size, 
the dot begin iterator, the sorting, and how you can output your vector. So guys, uh, I hope you li like the video, and I was useful. I was helpful to you. Please subscribe and support. Thanks for everything. Goodbye.